Hey everybody, welcome to the vlog today. I'm so nervous. I am going to the store in the market for the first time without John. Not by myself, because I got my helper, Esme. We are gonna have a good time, aren't we? <laughs> We're gonna see how I'm treated without my husband right next to me in public, because that's all I've really experienced so far, so. Just getting used to driving here in the Philippines and that's already pretty difficult but we've lived here nine months now I think it's about time that I go and do things on my own um, because that just makes sense for our family to be able to get some things done while John's working and so here we go guys come along with me as I shop at the market and the grocery store and drive myself for the first time here in the Philippines let's go today not just the market and the first thing I'm gonna do which is still scary but one of the easiest is to exchange our gas tank for our cooking stove so John put it in the back for me and he told me how to do it so I'm parked here to get one of those but um, I don't think they can see me because this bus is next to me so I'm just gonna wait and see if someone comes to help me I'm scared they're gonna ignore me because they're afraid to talk to me John said just try to make eye contact with them. So far they are not making eye contact. I don't blame them. What do I say? Kuya? I'm trying. I talked to two guys and I, I think he told me to wait here. So we'll wait here. Luckily that other guy's gonna bring me back my change and then I can leave. E e e e e. Sorry, it's e. You can go buckle up though. We're fine. Yeah. We're gonna go to the next place next. We need to go to the regular grocery store, which is not as hard as well. I can shop there because it's just like a regular grocery store. Then it's the market. That's the one. But it'll be okay. I have friends there. It's been nine months. I've been there many times, but right now I've just been sending John with a list because it's faster and easier. Thank you so much. Welcome, Mom. Thank you. Let's go. 
get it on out of here. He's still coming and he's doing this to me now. Wow, okay, that's quite the experience. <laughs> oh my goodness. Philippines is weird, man. Ooh. What is We're gonna see how I'm treated without my husband right next to me in public because that's all I've really experienced so far. So, shall see. Grateful I have Esme with me because she reminded me to lock the car. So that's good. And it's, it's less awkward to have someone with me and not be totally alone. But that was still crazy awkward. We've been talking about that yeah. silly guy. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's so dark. Sorry, guys. But we are at um, Robinson's now. I've been here many times, so I can handle this. Get all our groceries, huh? It's going great. So far, people are extra, extra nice to me. I'm saying hi a lot more often than when John's with me, actually. And then they're teasing and they're like, oh, hello, welcome to my vlog. So it's Okay, we've done pretty well. We did get a lot of snacks because we are going on a really awesome trip this week. We're gonna go to Romblon, which is a island nearby kind of-ish. We don't know what we're doing, but we need to go there for church, and so we're gonna travel there and it's gonna be fun. So I'm stocking up on snacks that the kids can have, because you never know with my kids if you can stop somewhere and just eat because they have allergies. So we're making sure we have food all the time. <laughs> okay, push. All right, how's it going so far, Yezzy? So far, the strangest thing about shopping on my own without my husband is that everyone says hi to me. Everybody. And, you know, people will say hi to me when John's with me, but this is like way more, okay? I'm getting tons of attention. And something you might not know about me is I am an introvert and I'm very reserved and I don't like a lot of attention. On top of being the center of attention in public, I'm also vlogging. And so this is just a lot for me today. But it's good practice for me, it's a good experience and it will help me grow, it's okay. Now is for the, maybe the hardest part or the most exciting part, going to the market. And I am prepared. I am not going to vlog because I can't think about all those things and trying to talk to people. So John hooked me up with the GoPro and yeah, I'm gonna wear it on my chest like a dork. But then you guys can see my shopping without me having to think about getting the camera. So let's get there, get this strapped on. <sighs> let's do this, guys. Ah, I'm so nervous. Esme, do you remember how to get to the market? Oh, good. Because I have never driven to the market before. Of course, I've ridden with John many times before. But when you're doing it yourself, it's different. Because you don't pay as much attention when you're not driving. This is where we used to walk from Zumba. So that's near the market. Let's try it. Aloha! Wait, Mama. Go in front of an ambulance. Ay, 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 I love you all. I'm sorry. Sorry. It's me, a white American. Woo hoo! You're supposed to stop for that guy. I know, I pulled out right in front of an ambulance, but there's no rules here. It's so crazy! I wish they had a red light. I know, I wish they also had lights or stop signs or something. Yeah. The problem I'm seeing is that there's no parking spot. So I'm gonna go get my fruit first, right? Ezzy, we'll just drive to the fruit place. Okay, now we just gotta find our fruit ladies. They're very nice, so this won't be too hard. I don't know what I'll tell you what this Tell me if you see them. There's a lot of jeepneys in my way. Oh, that's them there. That's them there. Should we just pull up here? Yep, there he is. What does mom? Well, it was a success and she gave me a discount. So thank you thank so you. much. See you next time. We got a parking spot, guys, right by the market. And I paid the guy. We got this. Now. You're funny. Okay, now I'm really gonna strap on the GoPro and stop thinking about the vlog. Gotta focus. Truthfully though, I'm having a great time. This is not too bad. My only worry with this is that they'll stop me 
from recording in the market, but. They probably will be too afraid to talk to me, so it'll be fine. Just gonna turn this on and get going. Old dorky dorky vlogger girl. We gotta get some pork. The pork ladies are nice, so this is gonna be just fine. Hello. I can't remember where we're supposed to go. Actually, maybe. Right here. Hello, pork. Come and stop, pork. Okay. He's at home working, so this is my first time coming on my own. <laughs> okay, I need three kilos for humba. Hello, Hello, how are you? How are you trying? <laughs> he's at home working, so he sent me to the market for my first time. <laughs> and then one kilo for sinigang. Um, not today. Just this, yeah. 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 Um, can we have six pork chops? Six slices. Yes. Mm -hmm. yeah. Two and fourteen. Does that makes sense. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Give you twenty. Thank you so much. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Ingat ka ingat. Yeah, take care. Ingat kayo. All right, thank you so much. Let's go to our vegetables. Bye, thank you. Okay, now it's the vegetables and sometimes this is the hardest part because it's crowded and... Okay, thank you. Kuya, do you have chili leaves? Okay. Can you get some of, of these? I need one of, of those. There you go. Okay, I think this is all I need. Hello. Can we buy these? 15, one five. One five? Yes, How about papaya? Ah, no thank you. Just this today. We did it. We really did it as a girl. Wow, I can't believe I got all these groceries on my own and the gas. Let me get home. That was so easy that I feel like I forgot something because we just got that done so fast and easy. I really am starting to think that I could do this on my own. I mean, let us just get home safely first, but. Salama po. All right, I would say that was a success and it's so good for me to do things like this and get over my fears because it's not as bad as I think. It's always easier. People are nice and they're gonna help me, but you always have those uncomfortable moments where you don't understand each other. Like that lady, she was saying, where, I think, like, where are you going? Because I told her we're going to Ron Blanc and I answered with, well, we're just gonna hang out with our friends tonight because I, I thought we were talking about where are you gonna have the home back? So there's always gonna be moments like that. And it's not just here in the Philippines with people here, it's everywhere and always. So that's life. Okay, do you remember where to turn, Ezzy? Because I am. Um, I'll tell you when. Three, two, one. Ezzy is a very good navigator. Okay, we're gonna turn here. It's the Zumba place. That's right, we're by the Zumba place. But I really appreciate you guys coming along with me as I experienced these things. And this was a real experience that I wanted to have personally. And so I'm glad I can also vlog about it and share it with you. If you guys like these kind of videos, I hope that you'll subscribe and give it a thumbs up so that we know and we can make more videos as we experience this whole adventure here in the Philippines. I have grown so much and changed so much coming here. And it's challenged me, but it's a very good thing. So I know that I talk about the discomforts of living here in the Philippines and a lot of people think that I don't like it here because of that. But I love it because even though it's not always easy, it's good for me and it's good for my kids. And that's what this is all about. 
All right, so thanks so much for watching and we will see you in our next video, which will be tomorrow. Bye.